A little bit about this course. We have five sections for this video course. The first section is decoding the larger language model and the generative AI. Second is about LLM architecture. Third section is about LLM technology stacks. Fourth section is open source versus closed source large language model. We will help you making the choice in the video. And finally, we have the hands-on demo. So a little bit of diving to each section in the decoding generative AI and the large language models. We will give some brief history of the AI and also define what is generative AI and give some examples. And then we will talk about the inner working of the larger language model, especially its attention mechanism, word embedding, and the fact that it's based on artificial neural network. It also has a transform architecture. Eventually, it was trained by the reinforcement learning with human feedback or RLHF. We also talk about its potential broader applications, as well as the reason why it will change the world and why the application will be very broad, not just limit to what we have here. And also, we will talk about the architecture in section two, especially the design pattern and the security controls. We we'll talk about uh, the prompt engineering with vector database, fine tuning, and using some of the function call and uh, plugins. And also, you can build your own LLM. And uh, then we we'll dive deep into some security controls for large language model. In the section three, we will talk about the technology stack and the security considerations that we need to be careful with. We analyze threat landscape and some of the countermeasures, as well as the secure operations and the regulatory concerns as well. The technology stacks are talk about some by the Amazon, Google, Azure, as well as the open source like Lanchain, Auto GPT, Pinecon, Llama Index, and Hugging Face hosted open source model. In the section four, we will talk about open source versus closed source. We'll give you some of the selection criteria. And then in the final section, we'll give you the hands on. We end the video with uh, some summary of what you have learned and also why you need to learn, like uh, as the cybersecurity. What's the impact of Gen AI and large language model impact? our profession and uh, also list uh, some tools that uh, you can use now or get uh, familiar with as this uh, uh, whole tool set is glowing uh, because larger language model and LLM has changing rapidly so you can always uh, follow my LinkedIn I will report some of your tools there but these are some tools which currently has the Gen AI space. To complete this video course, you do have some prerequisite understanding basic cybersecurity concept and also Python, as well as math and data handling. You do not need a GPU um, because we're using Google Colab for GPU, but uh, if you're just using Core i7 CPU, should be enough. A regular laptop should be good enough. And uh, with that, I wish you enjoy the course. Here we go.